it, it juts out behind because it's the attachment for the Achilles. So now that thing doesn't need to do anything but just stay at the very least hovering. There you go. And, it's, and here's it's why, okay. because if my Achilles is spiraled like this, okay, so in order to twist this thing properly, I can't have this moving. So what's happening is people are loading their foot inner ankle bone low, the heel's being loaded, and now this is happening to the Achilles. It's becoming linear and it's getting pulled on like this. Whereas if you just hold your heel up and it's always hovering and it's still because you're inner ankle bone high, now when the shin does its down, back, and out, you create this healthy integrity with the Achilles tendon. And this is the cycle. It's just boom, boom. It's just right. opening and closing. Opening That's and closing. That's your Achilles tendon. This is inside ankle bone low. Yeah. Heel in the ground. It's the ship. It's the rope that holds the ship. You start ruining the integrity of it. Yeah. And it becomes string cheese. Yeah. And the next thing you know, it just pops. Pops. And it's over with.